my gosh hello lovelies welcome back to my channel and today when doing this a simple ass look that you can tell you're like what the hell you normally have like some popping color eyeshadows or something crazy going on with your eyesights nope not today we're doing simple school girl type of look today this is super simple and this is what I came up with today simple easy anyone can do this look um, super affordable products which I tried to make sure these products on in this video was super affordable to use and easy to find and these are nowadays type of products that anyone could find and buy at the drugstore or probably get online for an affordable price i hope you guys enjoy this video and stay tuned to see how i got this simple look and this is the normal look i do for uni um not every day but some days when i feel like oh i want to put a bit of makeup today this is kind of the look I go for. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this video. Give this video a thumbs up, thumbsy, thumbsy, thumbsy up. Subscribe to my channel and I'll see you guys in the next video. Um, so <laughs> what I'm gonna do next is use the foundation, the Maybelline Fit Me in the shade Caramel. To concealer today I'm gonna to be using my Mac concealer so the next thing I'm gonna do is do my eyes I already um, applied concealer on my eyelids already so for my Z palette I'll be using this contour shade from Anastasia Beverly Hills to do the inner core crease of my eye since we're doing such a simple eye look today I'm not gonna jump into too much color no color today I'm just gonna have a neutral eye as neutral as possible is what I'm trying to go for because this is more of a school look and more of like a simple look you don't want to have it too flashy at school because it's not for good for school so you want to do like a simple look and that's what i'm trying to achieve today so that is why i'm going for the um my contour shade which i kind of like it's not that dark but i like it. it just it gives a nice set to the eye i love it so that's why i'm using it for the crease color today but yeah let's jump into it <laughs> so today i'm using the m322 um, concealer brush, concealer, I mean crease brush <laughs> to do in the crease of my eye. Now after I've applied this crease color now I'm going to go into the lid and I'm going to use my little NYX for real palettes which I made like a while ago. It's been about a year since I've made this palette. It's just for pretty ass colors that I really like. So we're gonna use this really gold shimmery. It's not that shimmery, because it's more of a school simple look. So I wanted to do like, just not too much shimmer, just like a little bit of shimmer for the lid so that you kind of look like you've got like an eyeshadow one kind of, but not really. But yeah, this is more a subtle look. And yeah, let's jump into this look. Um, if you want to know the names of this shadow, you can go into the description box below and you will find the name of the shadow I use for this look because I don't really know the name of it right now, but I will insert it down the bottom in the description. So yeah, go check it out. <laughs> to apply the lid color, I'm going to be using this L flat brush to apply that onto the lid. <laughs> So the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take this contour shade from Anastasia Beverly Hills. Um, all the names of these products will be linked down in the description below. So yeah, again, you can go check them out. I probably won't say the names in this video because I actually can't remember the names of them. I've had these, uh, I've been using this for about, about months now, a couple months now. I've been using this as my contour shade and it's amazing. So. Yeah, I'm going to be using this shade and I'm going to run it along the bottom of my lid. Mm -hmm. 
This is the under eye added. I'm now I'm gonna do mascara. I don't really do much mascara for my, like when I go to uni, I don't do mascara because my mascaras do get kind of messy and I like to like touch, be able to touch my face and I think, oh yeah, I have to be careful not to touch my eyes because mascara will get everywhere. So I don't really wear much mascara. So I probably sometimes apply like a little bit, but if this is for you guys sake, like school wise, I wouldn't suggest wearing mascara but i kind of do wear mascara sometimes some people do wear mascara but i kind of my favorite thing i'll just put a little bit for the sake of this video i'll put a little bit and that's me with a little bit of mascara um, normally for uni, I like to do wing. I should have done my wing first for mascara, but let's just try to do the wing. Yeah, I'm gonna use this model's own liquid eyeliner. Next thing I'm gonna do is I'm going to use this contour shade to contour my cheeks. After I've done that, I normally put some powder on, which I'm going to use my MAC powder. I know it's about to so finish, it's just like basically finished. But I'm just going to put some powder on my face and yeah. So I'm using this really fluffy new brush that I bought from BH Cosmetics. It's the 124. Oh, this feels super nice. This is nice. I just like to set my entire face with powder. Um, kind of my life right now. I do this a lot of times. Um, normally, don't wear too much makeup for uni. I like to be neutral as possible. But sometimes I do like to like glam up. These are the very times I do that. But yeah. But anytime I feel like I want to glam up, this is kind of the look I go for the most times. So now after all this powder, I like to do a little bit of blush and today's blush I'm going to use the Lati London Blush Crush which I, I don't know just shades of these, I honestly don't. Justin! <laughs> so the shade of this is called Justin. Oh wow, that's pretty. Then normally I use this model's own um, highlighter, which is called Light Golden Brown, and it looks like this. I think I, I use this a lot, a lot on my channel. So and I'm using this one, two, five highlighting brush. I've never used this brush before. First time using this brush. Let's just see how it does. Oh wow! Yeah, this is nice. Oh, this feels super weird to use. I've never used like a brush like this on my highlight. I like to like blend out my highlight to like nothing, like close to nothing as um, blended out as possible. I don't really apply highlighter on my cupid's bow on my nose when I go to uni, but I'll just tap like a little bit and that is it. Um, for lips, I like to do a simple, simple look lip. Product. With lips, I normally do the NYX Lingerie um, in the shade Teddy and normally I would do like a gloss alone and I would use the NYX Butter Gloss. Um, this, I don't know the shade of this. I normally do the nude lip gloss to this one. This is more of a pinky but it's not that pink but I like it. It's like neutral. It's not like too much when you get into uni you're like, everyone's looking at you like bro. Well, I should go on hot pink lip gloss like, nah, nah. See? See how pink it is? Um, I try to make sure it's, I put the lightest amount because you can tell it's like really white, so. Oh, my lips are dry today. But yeah, this is the simple ass finish look. Um, I don't use too much product for uni. I kind of keep it neutral and this is kind of the neutral look. Um, 
I kind of don't let my hair down or anything. I kind of like make sure my hair's back. It is school, it is uni, and you know when I got time to like have the hair all over their face, I kind of like do my makeup and my hair like this, which is simple. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. <laughs> Super simple. Give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.